Hello and welcome to Wandering Wanda. I'm Ariel. Today I'm going to cover tea storage. Originally, I bought this for my teas, which is what I use some of our homes. It's wonderful because it holds about 120 tea bags and teas and different teas. However, storage is very limited. So this is taking up a lot of storage space. Footprint is huge <laughs> for this box. I never quite realized how big this box is until you get it into an Airstream. So, we're going to not use this. This was wishful thinking. This is a really nice box too. Instead, we're going to use plastic that I get at Office Depot, Home Depot, or Office Depot, Staples, those office supply stores. It's a really useful box, which I use for almost everything here. And this one is 2.1 liters. So we're going to see if what's in here can fit in here. I'm gonna try to. English breakfast, love this stuff. And Earl Grey. Oh, look at that. It fits nicely. <laughs> Okay, when I make iced tea for Walter, he likes plain old Lipton black tea. <laughs> okay, these loose tea bags is the PG tips. These are the what the English like drinking and this is what I like also as far as just plain old black tea goes. It takes up a lot less storage room. <laughs> well, one of the kitchen kitchen things that I thought would fit, it doesn't, it's too big. Beautiful box. All right, well, thank you for watching. Watch as I purge a couple more things as I'm putting stuff in Wanda. I forgot. In this episode of tea items, for those of you who don't know, this is actually a tea maker. You put tea pellets in here or tea beads, seeds and then you pour hot water in it and it makes excellent tea. However, I'll show you in this next clip how this is not gonna be practical because the tea leaves when you're done, when it's done percolating, I generally just put it down the garbage disposal. There's no garbage disposal here. You have to watch what goes down in the sink because it goes into a container underneath the RV. So, this is one of the other tea items. 
that I'm sad to say is not going to be joining us only because it's not very practical as far as cleaning and I'm not going to maintain it or be that fastidious in cleaning this item. So this is going back to the sticks and bricks. Okay, that's RVology for a normal home with a foundation. So this is going into storage as a backup until one of my other ones break down. Okay. Hello and welcome to the Irvine House kitchen. This is what it looks like. It's very quaint. I love my little house here. Okay. Today I'm going to go over the reason why I'm not using this particular tea maker. I wish I could, but it's just not going to be practical for me inside of Wanda. We're going to wait until the hot water pot dings, which it should any moment now. But in the meantime, this is how I make tea. Jasmine green tea. Beads, I guess that's what they're called. I'm not really sure. Take one teaspoon. I think it's a teaspoon. One of these spoons. Put it in there. We wait for the hot water to ding. It just dinged. Pour it in. Close the lid and we wait about five minutes until all the seed pods or round pellets, they blossom into leaves. Okay, it's been about five minutes or so. The way this tea maker works, take it out. You don't even have to open the lid. You just put it on the cup and let gravity do its work. It's really neat. It presses down on this and it comes down from the bottom. Now 
Now I have hot tea. Nice, freshly brewed. Okay, back to the reason why I'm not using the tea container or the tea maker that I like using for the homes is because of this. That has to be cleaned out. And the way I clean it out is I fill it up with water again. And then I dump the tea leaves down the garbage disposal. That's it, that's how I clean these. And it's ready for use for the next time I make tea. Dumping it down the garbage disposal, it's not gonna work inside Wanda. There is no garbage disposal. And I don't want that going into the gray, into the gray tank. And for me to do this manually, it's never gonna happen. So, we're, we will be using tea bags inside of Wanda as opposed to my tea maker. Boohoo. Well, I hope you found my storage dilemmas inside Wanda amusing because it's frustrating me <laughs> in regards to storage. I have none inside of Wanda and it's beginning to dawn and it's beginning to dawn on me. <laughs> Like, oh, realization, reality, it bites. All right, bye.